Steve and I are kind of banging around in the garage and in this video we're going to show you how to use a load tester on a car battery. Before we get started, remember to subscribe to the channel, ring the bell, and subscribe to all of our notifications. That way they'll get a heads up when we upload a new video. Alright, so we've charged this battery. Um, so we're going to put a load test on it with this meter. It's a load meter. And, you know, these are $75 meter. You don't need a super expensive one. Um, we're going to clamp onto it, onto the connections. And, okay, so we have a good connection there. And if you look at the meter, right now it shows the battery at 12 volts. Well, you press the button down for the load and you leave it for 10 seconds. We want to make sure it doesn't go down into the red. And here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's passing right now. So now we're going to start the car and we're going to make sure that the, the um, gauge goes into the OK mark where it says 14 volts. So we're going to go start the car up. All right, so we're in the 14 for OK. So it's charging properly. Um, so that's great. So we got no issue here. Now, if you want to buy, you don't need an expensive tool to check your charging rate, OK? So we have another way that we're going to show you with an inexpensive multimeter. You can get these multimeters at the parts stores. Um, and you can pay as little as $20 for a multimeter. So we're going to put the multimeter here. We're going to put it on. Uh, voltage for 20 volts and we're going to touch these onto the battery terminals if you can hold that yep so the car is running and what are you reading 14.9 okay so our charging rate is a little high right now because we just charged this battery so we're going to put the vehicle outside and let it sit over the cold overnight it's not too cold but it'll hit the 30s and then we're going to try and start it again tomorrow morning and make sure that it charges this customers let this car sit all winter and we just want to make sure that the battery is good it's charging fine and um we just want to make sure that he's not going to get stuck now again we said this battery is over three years old and battery is peace of mind so what's a tow charge cost you so if I have any question on this battery, I'm gonna replace it due to the fact that it's not worth getting stuck on the side of the road to try and squeeze an extra six months of life out of your battery. And that'll finish it up. Thanks for watching the video. If you have any questions, leave a comment. I will reply back to you. Give the video a thumbs up if you like it. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.